All right, welcome back everybody to uh, episode two of Monotica Below Zero. We ended off saying that we're gonna explore that cave or the distress signal area. Which is probably in a cave somewhere, I think. Uh, yeah. Two hundred meters. Let's play that again. Sounds like a distress call. Transmission of unknown origin. Source of transmission depth calculated at approximately 200 meters. Oh right, yeah, so 200 meters. Gotta go over there. But first, I want to make a. I want to make a mobile vehicle bay because we have that on, like unlocked in the. Items to make, but we don't have any things for it. Blueprints. Hmm. We gotta find it. See, we got one. We actually got one of them. We need two more. I guess we can explore to find that. Probably like in a cave or something. Ooh, gold. Ore vein. Oh, sick. That is really cool. Another sea light fragment. Yeah, we can just explore, like, around us, you know? We haven't done that a lot. Yeah, we haven't seen this with these before. Oh, I'm frozen. Art? I don't even know what I'm picking up, guys. I really have no idea. Hmm. Alright, those things fall. I don't think we've explored right here yet. There's some stuff up here. Shit. Thermal Lily. You got like a base over here. Like I said, I'm just running around like the map. I want to destroy this cell, man. Outpost zero. We'll build our fragment. Definitely scan all this stuff because we definitely want to build it.
Oh. So I've got an ion cube. Already. Should have scanned it all. Oh, I already learned this stuff? That's pretty cool. Oh yeah, get that swivel chair, you know. Oh, looks like I've got a control room. That's basically like the uh, scanner room, Subnautica. Like, we're gonna scan a bunch of crap in here. Oh, it's a picture of a cat. Oh, potato. I miss that fluffy little couch walrus. That's potato? <laughs> Say hi to my kids. I told them I'd show them a day in the life of a scientist. <laughs> of course. Hi, Orin. Hi, Svea. Tell us what you're working on. Oh, um, this is a personal project. Looks more like biology than robotics. Yeah, I was just thinking, I know no one is on my side with this, but what if I just found a way to take care of the deadly bacteria? I, uh, I wouldn't say no one is on your side. I'm on your side. I know, but you won't say anything to Emmanuel or Zeta or anyone. What effect would it have if I did? I'm not exactly employee of the month right now. I know. I wouldn't want you to risk more than you already have. I'm sorry. I wish I could do more. What? What are you working on there? And what do you mean by take care of the deadly bacterium? Uh, is that thing still recording? Oh, right. Uh, so, that was Sam, kids. I'll turn this off now. Motivational posters were banned from Xenoworks following a lengthy discussion at the annual company retreat three years ago. This poster is technically contraband. Okay. So we got contraband on this, and we are getting so much stuff to build. Like this, got a power cell charger and a water thing, water filtration. Another PDA. Uh, a bunch of PDA stuff. Got a window here. Locker. We got quarters right here. Was this Sam space? What was she doing all the way out here? Robotics by Penguin Development. Okay. So we're gonna get a lot of information choice. here. I have to neutralize the bacteria myself. I'm a little nervous. Okay, terrified. But this thing is a death sentence. We shouldn't be messing around with it. I'm no biologist, I know. So does everyone else here. I haven't spoken to Danny since we fought about it. Zeta said she'd handle it and then didn't. Lil practically begged me to drop it. This is completely beyond the scope of your work. You have to stop before you jeopardize your standing with the company. I don't want good standing with a transgov that would do this. Robin tried to warn me. Maybe she was right, and Altera really is unfixable. Maybe I deserve better than this. We all do. 
I've synthesized the antibacterial agent. <laughs> I know my biochem at least well enough to do that much. I've stashed some away in one of the Pengling research caves, southeast of the Leviathan. That was probably the easy part. Now I just have to carry out the plan. Focus, be brave, worry about what happens next after the threat is neutralized. They're going to know it was me. If they send me home, what? When they send me home, where the ice isn't 20 feet thick, I can get my Augie bum back. We can cuddle under a nice warm blanket. Things with Robin will thaw out. They always do. Besides, I think she'll respect this. And then, maybe I'll start my own research outfit with an awesome team. I'd love to work on prosthetics again. Help people find peace and ease in their bodies. No more cold. No more spying. Nothing that can be misused. <sighs> All right. Now's my time. I've got this. Okay, we got a lot of stuff. Potato. You are a good cat. We're just taking everything from here. And we got another PD in here. Ah, oh, my darlings, Brian, Svea, and Oren. I'm counting the days until I can come home and give you all the hugs and kisses. Since my research project was cancelled, they have me at a place called Outpost Zero doing nothing much. Just cataloging things, plants, the occasional animal, but it's mostly ice where I am, so... There's not a lot of new stuff to find. Svea and Oren, you know how you get bored when your hover dance teacher makes you practice skills 15 minutes over schedule and it eats up your freestyle time? It's a bit like that. But I have a new roommate, Samantha, a roboticist. You should see her little bangling box. Oren, you'd love them. But she got management upset. I guess this is just where they send you if they decide you're too much trouble. I'm kind of <sighs> glad she's here, though. I was getting lonely. I'm still trying quietly. I don't want any more trouble to figure out where I went wrong. I was sure. I picked up a distress signal. I, I was right on top of it, and then it just stopped. What if someone, an architect, is still down there and, and needs help? <laughs> I'll be home before I ever get to find out, and it will fall to some future researcher to come and find out, I guess. I, I hope, but oh, I can't wait to be home with you. When are you going to send me some more art? There's still a patch of bare wall here that could use some colour and a touch of genius. I miss you. I love you. I hope you're still proud of me. I'm proud of you. Cool, that's interesting. Ask list. Burnish prawn suits repair, base hatch door lock. Oh yeah, we have a bunch of crap on us. Hey, can I pick this fruit? Probably could. I can. All right. Nope, I want that. I think I pretty much got everything in this um, outpost area. Command post? I don't know. Got a sea glide fragment. There's stuff down there. Oh, full light, yep. Uh, I've oh, got a prawn suit already? Well, not alright, let's see. Mark three. How much do we need? We need four stuff of that.
Now we got two now. Let's go back inside because we're uh, way too cold. Way too cold. This actually gives 74 body heat, which is pretty good. Uh, okay. Guess we have to find the other prawn suit like stuff to press them like away from here. They would not all be in the same place. Some type of launch pad right here. Nothing over here. Unknown signal. Thank you very much, plant. Approaching. Seek shelter. Oh boy, got some alien technology. Don't tell me this is where the frozen Leviathan is. Okay, not frozen Leviathan, but something even more scary. I can't tell what's in there, it looks like... Like some wreckage or something? I don't know. There's no thing we could put in it too, a tablet thingy. Alright. You, you probably have to go back to that. Does uh go through that door at some point? Dangerous weather, huh? Okay. Yeah, we should go to that uh, unknown signal actually. Like more my beacon is. That's where I. That's where I put the beacon. And uh, I heard the signal. Smart idea. I'll post zero. Egg. Do we have one of these? I oh, don't know, we're picking it up. Could I scan right? Th I haven't scanned this dude yet? Really? Okay. You buddy. It looks like it's just um 
There's old stuff here. Like stuff we already saw. It gets deep right here. It gets real deep and dark over here. It's not what I like to see. Holy f is that? It's like a huge ass whale or something. Holy crap. Oh. Alright, we gotta unload this battery. Okay. What the f was that? This is not the time for my tools to be. Oh shit. Holy f <gasps> Oh shit. <sighs> oh, I got where's this f surface at? Oxygen. Oxygen. Yes, I know oxygen. I'm trying to worry about the thing I just saw. Holy shit. The thing was huge. Oh, let's not go over there yet. Let's, uh, wait. Do we have, like, better sh shit? How did I not see this before? Inventory full. The big claw machine. Oh. Warning. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. There's a pathfinder tool, okay. More stuff right there. There's a PDA. Ah, jeez. These sea monkeys are gonna get me in trouble. This is the third shipment that those buggers have gotten their weird little hands into. Now we're running low on flares, and I'm gonna have to search nearby nests for stolen cargo. They're lucky they're kinda cute. Raccoons of the sea, those ones. That's it. So, search sea monkey caves. Got it. Cargo. Oh yeah, we also gotta build a base somewhere because we want all the stuff to build it. I know the brightest ideas can flourish in the middle of nowhere, but geez, it's practically off the map. Who names an inhabitable place Outpost Zero? Sounds like a prison. Most people would jump at the opportunity to get paid and sit and do nothing. Not Sam. She was always ready to work and always looking to make things better. I can't believe Altera cut her down while she was just getting started. And they have the nerve to call her negligent? I think they drove her to an extreme. What did they want Sam to do out there? Fix faulty wiring kits and, I don't know, write poetry to pass the time? Nothing wrong with poetry, but they hired her to do what she was best at. Build robots. She must have been miserable out here. Hmm.
Computer chip, battery, wiring kit. Okay. Like that. Two weird implants, two coral. Right, we did not have that creature again. Glass for this thermos. Beacon signature detected. Unique identifier. Delta Station Dock. Delta Station. This is the place Lil mentioned in her message. Oh, yeah, it's a radio place. So you want me to go back over there where the freaking. I don't even know what was trying to attack me. I don't know for sure it's back over there. Where's this thermos at? Okay, we need fiber mesh. Do we have fiber mesh? We do. Can I do with this? Or beverages. Can't put water, so I'm guessing I could put like coffee in it or something? I don't know. The... I want a computer chip and a battery. So, two table coral. Yeah, let's go. I do have everything. I do have everything. Actually, I think I need two room plants for the battery. Yep. I need uh, river plants. So I'm probably gonna have to go in a cave. They got most of the ones near me already. Never mind. Yes, I didn't. Every time I say that. There's two copper in here. I need one copper, but another battery. Damn. We got the habitat build. Let's go. Adding emergency shelter blueprints to your data bank. With the builder tool, you can construct sea bases from raw materials, advising against exploring a frozen water continent without a base. No bed, no storage, no place to put a fabricator module. No fun. We have room plants. Yes, let's go. That means more batteries. Yeah, I was definitely need to build a base in. Probably in this episode. Anyway, let's see. Oh boy, we got a lot of stuff. Bunch of stuff to make. Uh, six titanium. Okay. Now we're gonna have to find a good spot. Preferably out kind of over there ish. Maybe like over there. A lot of area. 
you know? Oh, yeah. They changed it so you have to build a... Phase test stuff in here. Well... It's the floating air pump. Do we have the air pump? No, we don't. I guess we're using the floating one for oxygen. Alright, let's find a base spot. This right here doesn't look dangerous. Will Shrock go away if we build right there? And no, it won't. I'm just gonna build right here. Any more titanium? Okay. Let's go grab more. I guess this can go right here. What the heck do I even attach this to? I just look at it right there. Warning. Emergency power only. Oxygen production offline. I totally forgot how to work one of those. Oh. Of course we need copper ore. Better get some like free copper out of this, I'll be happy. And we got two. And we got three. Test something. We have action. What's the purpose of this? Nothing? I thought we needed that for our base. Alright, we have a base. Kinda. Still need a lot more stuff. And let's see. Large room, yeah. Probably not gonna get that soon. Is 
there's a fabricator. Uh, fabricator will be in this middle room. You know, I like to have a middle central room if you guys didn't know that already. I make two. Ah, and two copper and two quartz. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Alright, now we gotta make uh, lockers. So. Quartz. Pretty sure we got a bunch in here. Never mind, I think I actually took the quartz with me. We have two in here, that should be enough. Yeah, that should be plenty. Make lockers, a few lockers. Perfect. Right, here comes OCD. That looks, that looks good. Let's get everything uh, from our base and put it in our new base. Alright, get the lots of items and put them on my new base and then uh, we can go check out that unknown signal. I built some like foundation things at the bottom, huh? I like right about here, right? Yeah, I'm just gonna build them right here. Two lead. And we only have one lead. That freaking sucks, dude. Give you lead. 
Please be blood. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Boy, sea truck fragment, let's go. Oh, you could be a fragment, let's go. Let's go, we got lead. Cool, we need to build a sea truck too. Hmm. I want to destroy this though. I was trying now. Build this thingy. And we can build a room. We might need a platform right there. It looks like we're gonna need lead. Okay. At least we got the this thing situated. This cross area. Here we go, got you. All right, let's get all this stuff. Construct, please. Put it all in here. Another battery, I guess. I should have another solar panel. Two titanium, two quartz copper. Actually, our power is good. But it could be better, you know. There we go. We should have like iron fifty power. The ship. How much is it for this bulkhead door? Three titanium and silicone rubber. We are gonna put it. Uh, which side? <sighs> which side do I want to put it on? I really don't know. This is side for now. That yeah, should be good. There we go. All right, now we can explore some areas. I can't plunge the oxygen with this. No way. Uh, where did you come from, dude? Brute shark. Right there, sharks. You can plus action with the air bladder? I did not know that. Alright. 
Well, let's see where the signal is. 200 meters. Warning. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. There it is again. stuff. Sarchin power. Critical. Hello? Is someone there? In the manner of speaking. We're running out of time. What the heck was that? What is all this? Seeking emergency storage medium. I can help you better if you show yourself. If we could show ourselves, we would not need storage. You mean you don't have a physical presence? Are you one of them? An architect? Storage medium identified. We will be lost unless we find a new host. Can you help? Can you use my PDA for storage? You are not with the group from before. Your cybernetic components bear their signal. Altera? No, my equipment is, uh, borrowed. It will have to do. Oh my god, I am cube heaven, holy crap. Apparently the facility is speaking to me now, that's great. I'll be stealing your ion cube if you don't mind. Holy crap, what the fuck is that? How long have you been stored here? Longer than you. Sanction power. Critical. Our data can be downloaded from the terminal. We may speak more once the transfer is complete. Yes, okay. Hurrying. Storage medium accepted. Brace for Chester. Brace? What the heck? <laughs> Transfer complete. How do you feel? Why do you sound like you're inside my head? The facility identified hospitable capacity within your cerebral cortex. You are in my head? I offered you my PDA. Get out! Oh, no. Does your kind perceive a boundary between cybernetic and organic components? My mind is not a component! You sound angry. We will allow you a moment to process. Don't you go silent on me. Hello? This is not happening. This is not happening. That's the explanation. It's not happening. Uh, I'm pretty sure it is happening. This is most definitely happening. Alright, so now I got an alien in, in my head. That's great. Maybe he can help us. So that was the distress signal. The alien was a distress signal. Got it. So now I guess we just leave.
on a rebreather. Looks like a sea truck fragment. Let's go. Sweet, sweet. I need one more of those. I got inventory space, so. Well, let's go. We can build vehicles. Ooh, another sea truck fragment. Let's go. New blueprint synthesized. New technology acquired. See something down there. Cheese on a cracker. Saw me. Managed to eject the cargo modules and hide. Sitting here with the lights off, sweating through my shirt. I'm not gonna get pooped out of the back end of a sea monster to save Altera some money. Manuel. Not going to be happy. Not one bit. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Alright, cool. We can build a sea truck. Let's go. Get rid of that unknown signal. What the? We understand this arrangement is undesirable to you. You're not real. Go away. To go, we require a suitable body for transfer. Why do you keep saying we? How many of you are there? One of us and all of us. We do not think of ourselves as individual, distinct. Why don't you start by telling me who you are? You may append your seed code to my species designation. Please call me al -Am. My whole life I've been dying to meet a sapient, space-fearing alien up close, and you're telling me your name is Alan? Is it insufficient? No, it's fine. It's perfect. Where are you from, Alan? Your kind calls us architects. A precursor race? But what are you doing here? That is a long story. Perhaps you would prefer to focus on the construction of a new storage medium to which I may transfer. Yes. Fine, absolutely. How do we get you out of my head? I have added the information to your data bank. You will need to find the necessary components. Any idea where I can find them? It is unclear. I have been disconnected from my network for so long I cannot locate the coordinates. <sighs> uh, okay. Research. Research stuff. Uh, oh boy, look at Kaina and Nickel already. I'm joking. Uh, let's make uh, the mold Yoko. We need some lubricant. Well, rebreather, we definitely need that. Architect components, architect tissue, architect scales, and architect organisms. That's gonna be fun. Fire mesh and silicone rubber. And a wiring kit.
All right, uh, uh la, 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 la. I remember we need two creep vine samples. Let's see what we need for the seed truck. Uh, not too bad, not too bad. Could be a lot worse. Arctic Ray. Survival rate would be greatly enhanced with the construction of an underwater vehicle. Oh crap, Lee, that's what I'm trying to build. Rebreather facilitates extensive free diving by recycling air more efficiently at significant depths. Breathe the freedom. Hmm. Cool. More locker space. Let's go. Put like one battery, or yeah, we could put like an extra battery in there. All right, I think that about ends it for today's video. Uh. Found a lot of interesting stuff in today's video, didn't we? And now we can build a sea truck. Let's go. Uh, should you guys know if you liked the video, please uh drop a like down below. It's greatly appreciated. You don't have to. It's free though. Uh, so yeah. See you guys in the next video.